Welcome back to Brick by Brick. Today we're going to be going over whether or not you should invest in a LEGO set after it has retired. So this set right here is LEGO set 40658, the Millennium Falcon Holiday Diorama. It has 282 pieces. This was an exclusive set that has gone up in value already. It retired. It wasn't around for too long. It was just for the holiday season. But it's already gone up in value by about, um, I believe, like 15% or so, which is pretty good. And that trend is likely just going to continue. It's got some great exclusive elements to it. It has these two exclusive minifigures in it, the Finn and Ray, as well as just a bunch of other cool little pieces and interesting pieces and characters throughout the set. You also get the Chewbacca figure, the BB-8, and one of the little Porg things there. And uh, they're all great additions to the set. You get some great minifigures for a relatively inexpensive set, which is always a good combination. And uh, I do think that this set is likely going to continue to go up in value, but it's a lot more risky to buy a set like this than to buy a set that you can already get on sale that is about to retire or going to be retiring soon. That's really the way you're going to want to do it, just because there's a little less risk if you're able to get it for a cheaper price, because it will likely go up in value, especially if it's a Lego Star Wars set but it is sometimes hard to tell how much it will go up in value. So you're going to need to buy sets when they're on sale just to help get uh, ahead of the price a little bit. But if you are confident a set is going to do well and it has already retired, I've never done that to buy a set after it retires to hope it goes up in value even more. It just seems a little more risky to me. But if you are willing to do that, it could be a good way to add some uh, diversification to your LEGO investing portfolio. But it's a little more risky to do than just buying the sets on sale. Feel free to let me know if you have any questions and don't forget to subscribe.